Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is me again, Clang, and you are going to see my professional side. So as you all know guys, I am a teacher and today I'm going to teach you how to make breakout rooms in Google Meet. But before that, don't forget to like this video and hit subscribe. So there you are. Today we are going to discuss how to make breakout rooms in Google Meet. There are only three things that we need. First is the Google Meet, second is the Google Classroom, and third is the Google Slides. So I'm going to go to my Google Classroom. Okay, so there are three things or three ways that you can see the Google Meet link. First is in the banner. So there you are. Second is in here. In classwork you see this link you can click that one and the third one is in here um, as you can see there is a drag down you can reset anytime the Google Meet link but for now I'm going I'm not gonna reset that because I already used the link in the pre in the slide that I'm going to show you later so um, also you can make this visible to students. So this is visible to, to the students in the banner that I showed you earlier. If this is uh, tick like that, it will not show up in the banner. But I'm gonna um, use that for now. Okay. So I will go back to the stream and then copy this one. Oops, there you are, copy. And then I already made this one in the Google Slides. So I made four rooms or breakout rooms for my class. So you can also put the name of the students for each breakout room so that they know, okay, so that they know which breakout room they will go, okay? So I already made, um, this room one two and three i already put the link on it now i'm going to show you you will just need to highlight this one oops okay you will just need to highlight this one and then click this one insert link and then paste okay and then you will change this part okay room four so we are in room four there you are. Okay, so this one I already clicked this one earlier. This is the um, the main Google Meet of the class. All right. So I will join now. Make sure you are joined. Okay, there you are. Before you sh um, start the breakout session, and then okay, let's say I will open this room number one. Oops, there you are. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you can see the name of the Google Meet is room one. Okay, how about room number three? Okay. You will see room three for the... Um, for this Google Meet. But before you join, you have to make sure that you have a uh, mute and turn off the camera. Okay, so there will so there will be no feedbacks. You can turn on the camera if you want, but make sure that you turn off or mute yourself. And then you can now join, you can click join now. And then you will also do the same thing on the other one join now so you can remotely um, check what your students are doing so if you want to check your class remotely if you want to see both of their classroom you can add to your Chrome extension 
these dualists to split or merge windows, I will just click this one. All right, I will choose five by five. I'll be I'll be showing only through breakout rooms. There you are. You can see both of your class. All right. So let's say you will give them only five minutes to do the breakout session, and then few minutes or five minutes before the time, you can just go to the chat room and click. All right, go back to the main uh, Google Meet. All right, and then copy the link. There you are. So I hope you learned today. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Thank you for listening. Have a great day.